Hello and welcome to today's video where I'll be tying the elk hopper. I'm tying this on a size 8 hook. I'll start by laying down the thread base using some black thread. For the tail, strip off fibers from a red hackle and secure to the hook. For the butt, grab some yellow wool and take apart one strip. Fold the tip like so and secure before cutting out the excess. Secure a brown hackle feather at the same point as the wool. Since we'll clip the brown hackle short, no need to use your good quality hackle. Once that is secured to the hook, Grab the yellow wool and wrap that around the hook to form the body of the fly. At the two thirds point, finish off with a few thread wraps and cut out the excess yellow wool. I'll then wrap the brown hackle over the wool, taking spaced out wraps. Finish off at the two thirds point and cut out the excess. At this point, grab your pair of scissors and trim off the brown hackle at the top and bottom. For the wing of the fly, grab some natural elk hair and snip off a small bunch. Hold the hair by the tips and take out the fur for easier stacking. Stack the elk hair and secure it to the hook. The elk hair should align with the bend of the hook. Cut out the excess elk hair and take thread wraps to cover up the clipped part. Next, grab a grizzly and brown hackle feather and take out the fibers before securing to the hook. Add some head cement at this point to hold everything together. Wrap both hackles simultaneously towards the eye of the hook and finish off with a few thread wraps. Whip finish and cut out your thread. The hackle should extend slightly past the hook gap. Finally add some head cement to the thread for durability. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.